Yo, what up, YouTube? Today, I want to talk about a topic that um, I've searched all over the internet, Reddit, YouTube, and I had a lot of conflicting, conflicting information even before I made my purchases. Um, I, I was hoping that um, the video card that you see on the screen, the 3060 Ti, would be able to mine Ergo. So this video is about proving, for my case, that the video cards that I bought, the 3060 Ti's, this six GPU rig, does not work well. I mean, it mines Ergo, but not its full capacity. The LHR, uh, you know, that limiter, the hash rate limiter that got implemented in these Ti versions, it did affect the 3060 Ti. So I'm um, just gonna walk through some of the steps I go through in simple mining OS to verify that indeed, indeed it did get affected um, and I, I was using T-Rex miner and uh, NB miner and I thought it was either either or that that was the problem but you know it ended up being both of them and I saw a couple of other videos from other folks that actually had the same results and some other people on the internet claim oh no it works blah 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 um, so we'll we'll give it a spin all right without further ado I'm gonna go to my simple mining OS um, tab over here and I'm going to configure my Sixer GPU uh, into a uh, Ergo mining machine so T-Rex Ergo and the overclocking setting that I have is uh, da -da -da -da, what do I have? Uh, 3060 uh, Ergo okay um so i'm gonna do this i'm gonna save and i'm gonna reload and i'm gonna show you here that for a split second it actually mines at its full capacity so to speak um which is like around 150 um mega hashes let me see is that it uh right here see it's jumping maybe not yesterday it was it was doing this but nevertheless it's mining at 80 90 uh the zotac all of the mo the majority are evgas but the zotac is actually outperforming them in this regard must be something with it, its hardware um but you know i should be getting let me let me clear this thing on what to mine it's telling me that with six uh, 3060 TIs on this algorithm the auto Lycos I should be getting 930 mega hashes which is roughly um, in ergo dollars 21 and 90 $21.95 a day um, so you know we know that ethereum is already limited so that's out of the question it's you know 245 or something like that so ergo is the one that ends up up top at the top in this profitability calculation but i'm getting 84 <laughs> 550 so it did get limited i'm not getting anywhere near 900 at all um, and I can I try different settings um, I am, I'm going back to the OC settings I'm gonna put everything on in, in, uh, on stock mode so the the lead offset zero memory offset zero power limit I think these are 200 right fan speed 80 save and reload um, let's see this thing okay start mining over here it's it's executing it's reloading my rig so we'll see <clears throat> excuse me all right maybe it'll jump into that little full potential there you go you see that 153 153 149 153 boom 147 124 111 live data right here where the LHR uh, restriction kicks in and this is before any of the overclocking settings have kicked in because it's got like a 60 second timer 
it's just unfortunate um, in that regard. If you're an Ergo fan, me, I'm a, I bought these specifically for the Ravencoin um, Kapow algorithm. I will be mining Ravencoin. I'm a fan. I've always been a fan, and I'm going to stay a fan. So, but, you know, for the Ergonauts and the fans, sorry. I know the 3060 Ti is the most bang for the buck. You know, it stays cool. Uh, the, the the price range is not ridiculous. You know, it's not a fifteen hundred dollar card. You can get them. I got them for seven hundred and fifty. Uh, some seven forty. So it's just it's just unfortunate. Ethereum and Ergo are definitely out of the question. So the only thing that I can mine that would be profitable is um, Ravencoin. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So I hope you guys see and, and once and for all, if you had questions about it, see for yourselves that this thing is definitely limited. I wanted to show this example. I thought it was interesting that all of them shot up to 150 and then boom, it's just fluctuating between 80, 90 and all that. Uh, it's, it's, it sucks, but that's reality. Uh, maybe in the future there will be a hack like the NB miner, which I doubt. I think the NB miner is 70% uh, hack on the Ethereum. I haven't even tried it on Ergo. I haven't tried it. Maybe it'll work, but 70%? Um, you know, we'll we'll see. But that's another video, another another time to experiment, and we'll we'll give that a whirl. Appreciate you clicking on my video, um, and I'll catch you on the next one. See ya.